fourth lecture of uh, pharmaceutical biotechnology about the uh, excipients used in parenteral uh, formulations of biotechnology uh, products. As you know, molecular biologists can produce recombinant protein drugs and pro uh, produce pure products. Purification process of proteins trips away carbohydrates, salts, lipids, and other undesirable proteins which are in natural environment. This purification process could, uh, could make the protein drug less uh, stable. Protein is sensitive to processes such as shear, agitation, enzymatic, and uh, chemical degradation, and uh, also aggregation. Biotechnology products uh, composition divided into two parts, uh, active substances and uh, excipients. Protein formulation uh, should be uh, should stabilize uh, protein from chemical and physical degradation. Uh, the goals of uh, protein formulation are easily uh, administered, efficacious, uh, adequate stability for shelf life uh, for marketing, and uh, the product must be uh, simple. Proteins have the ability uh, for aggregation under certain conditions by, by forming hydrophobic and hydro, uh, electrostatic uh, interactions. To avoid these uh, chemical interactions, proper conditions should be found. This slide shows the uh, components found in uh, parenteral formulations. Of biotechnology products, not necessarily all of above are uh, present in one uh, particular protein formulation. Many glycosylated proteins uh, may have a tendency to aggregate and uh, precipitate. To uh, prevent these uh, reactions or phenomenon, uh, uh, solubility enhancers must be used like uh, using a proper pH uh, addition of uh, amino acid, uh, acids like uh, lysine or uh, arginine, which usually uh, used to solubilize uh, TPA, or using uh, a surfactant like SDS uh, with uh, interleukin-2. This scheme illustrates uh, the effect of arginine, uh, arginine amino acids on uh, type 1 and type 2 uh, TPA. By this additive, the solubility increases. Some proteins tend to uh, expose hydrophobic sites uh, when an interface is uh, present. These interfaces, which are usually uh, hydrophobic, can be water-air interface, water-container wall interface. Uh, therefore, uh, anti-absorption agents Added to reduce, uh, are added to reduce absorption of the active protein to these interfaces. This uh, figure shows, uh, shows the uh, proposed mechanism for aggregation uh, of insulin in aqueous media through uh, contact with a hydrophobic surface. Uh, each circle represents a monomeric insulin molecule. Dimeric form of insulin absorb uh, absorb to the hydrophobic uh, interfaces and subsequently forms l uh, larger uh, aggregates at the interface insulin is one of the uh, many proteins that can uh, form fibrillar uh, precipitates uh, low concentrations of phospholipids Surfactants, also uh, selection of the proper uh, pH, can help to prevent this unwanted, unwanted uh, phenomenon. Mechanisms of surfactants is very important because uh, these molecules uh, readily uh, absorb to uh, hydrophobic interfaces with their own hydrophobic groups and render this interface hydro hydrophilic by exposing their hydrophilic groups to the aqueous uh, phase. Example uh, include uh, uh, polysorbate uh, 20 and 80. 
buffer selection is an important uh, part of the uh, formulation process because of protein solubility, physical and chemical stability depend on pH. Buffer systems regul regularly uh, encountered in biotechnology formulations and includes phosphate, acetate, and citrate buffers. Uh, protein rich in methionine, cysteine, tryptophan, tyrosine, and histidine are uh, susceptible to oxidative degradation. The solution for this effect or a problem include the replacement of oxygen by inert gases uh, in the vials help to reduce oxidative stress. Also, addition of antioxidants such as, uh, such as uh, uh, ascorbic acid or sodium formaldehyde, uh, sulfoxidate. Certain proteins are formulated in the uh, container designed for uh, multiple injection schemes and contamination with microorganisms may occur. Mercury containing phenyl, uh, mercury nitrate, uh, phenol, benzyl alcohol, and chlorobutanol are antimicrobial agents mentioned in the USP. Sugar and uh, polyhydric uh, alcohol uh, uh, can stabilize the protein structure through the principle of uh, preferential exclusion as illustrated in the following uh, diagram.